All right, this is uh, my the 86 Nissan D21 truck. I noticed the uh, power windows went out. Well, I noticed the passenger power window went out. So I checked here the fuses. And uh, you can see there's two blue fuses in there, up here. These guys, that, that could be the problem, but in this case it wasn't. Or it could be these two blues, these 15s, and that was not it. And it was not those. So, and it's not the motor. And so what it was, was uh, that rubber gasket right there. It got in the way of this. So now it works. So it was the switch. And it wasn't the motors. It was the switch, this little rubber gasket. It has to be oriented just right. And uh, that's why my power windows did not work. Um, my whole thinking was is that, uh, why would the passenger do motor fail before the uh, driver's side? And it was just the going up portion of the driver's side that failed, not the the down motion, just the up. So that was kind of a mystery. And uh, I thought, well, you know, maybe there's a wire that's been torn or something, but that was not it. It was not the fuses, was not the relays. What it was was a little plastic gasket that fits right here. And somehow it was blocking it. So it could be that simple. Um, these little D21 trucks, Nissans are bulletproof, these hard hard bodies. Um, mine's got like 255,000 miles. It's a beater of a truck, but you know, it's a work truck. So if you have problems with your power window, it's either the motors, it's either the switches, it's either the relays or the fuses or the wiring to them. But in this case, it was something real simple. I'll catch you on the next YouTube.